Hey everybody, happy Saturday. Today is the first day of the month. It is August 1st and we are here all day to inspire you. Um, whether you find yourself in one of these stories that are gonna be shared over the course of today or you're just looking to set your goals, reset Mommy. this, this uh, Saturday, we're here Mommy. for you and Mommy. I'm gonna kick it off with my own story um, here, and I've got a whole lineup of people today that are from all walks of life, all ages, Mommy. all professions. Everybody raised their hand and they said, you know what? I wanna work on becoming a better version of myself, and that's exactly what they did, and they're gonna inspire you today. So be ready, there's gonna be lots of live videos. If you miss them, you can always watch the replay whenever you kind of need that inspiration, right? We always find that low and we can definitely go back up and raise it. Jordan, quickly, what do you want to say? I'm going to draw my try thing today. She is going to try something new. We got the kids into Taekwondo and we're excited and um, she's going to experience that today. Uh, but before she's going to enjoy her strawberries, I want to introduce myself, share my story, and then um, throughout the day, you guys are going to get a load of brand new people that are going to be talking to you. Um, so you won't be hearing from me all day, but my name is Lindsay Harm. Um, I live in Omaha, Nebraska. This is my daughter, Jordan. She's four. My son, Landon, is eight years old. My husband works full times in the corrections um, center in our in our city. Um, he's a corrections officer. Tough job. Yes. I left corporate America seven years ago to really go out there and do what I love. And that's inspiring people to to become you know better when it comes to their health and fitness. And it's something I love. I've been a fitness trainer now for 14 years. I teach about six to 15 classes a week up at the gym. I run boot camps at the park. I live and breathe fitness. And for years, I was so into going out there and just trying the next thing, right? Working with supplements, many of which probably weren't healthy for me, but at that time, they served a purpose in my life. I became a mom eight years ago when I had Landon, and my whole view about my own health started to change. It wasn't so much about how I looked in a bikini or you know the compliments that people gave me. It was more about my mental health as well as my muscles. I have a goal today to preserve Preserve my lean muscle mass and to really be there cognitively as my body starts to age because I know for a fact I take care of myself and my body's going to last forever and ever, but I need something that's going to be that best fuel for my brain. Um, so about eight months ago, nine months ago, gosh, very close. We're going to come up on a year here um, in October where I started supplementing my own lifestyle with exogenous ketones, um, better fuel, better energy, focus, moods sleep, skin, appetite, many of which you guys have already started to notice in your own life, better fat loss, started drinking that. It's a fuel source. It's technology. We lead with education here um, at Prove It, and it's been completely life-changing for me. Before I started drinking the ketones, I noticed that my sleep was very, very, very short-lived, right? And when you don't get quality of sleep, your whole day starts to change, and things start dwindling, and you're not producing at the best version of yourself. I started noticing I needed naps in the afternoon when my kids were born. I needed to rest. I was working myself out so much at the gym. I started losing some of my lean muscle mass because I was not getting ample recovery time. I also noticed that... Um, that uh, my focus in the afternoon was all over the place. Like I was just not productive in a business where I needed to be productive. So because of ketones, I have been able to definitely sleep a solid night. My lower levels of stress have really contributed to more focus in the afternoon. I don't need an afternoon nap. Sissy needs a nap though, right? She likes to sleep and every once in a while we'll take a little nap together. I become a better mom. I call ketones my mom fuel. I've been getting a lot of rest, a lot of rest on those muscles. I've dropped 4% body fat. I feel like I'm in the best shape of my life and I turned 39 years old in October. So I hope this story finds you. I hope this inspires you. I'm just a regular mom here in the middle of the country who said, you know what? I want to inspire people to be better. And I'm excited to share this journey and the ketone conversation with all my friends and family, because I really believe that all of us every day want to work to improve no matter where you're at in your own life. So prepare to be inspired today. Thanks for kicking it off with me. I hope you guys have an awesome day and we'll talk to you all soon. See you later. Bye-bye.